I think I've only did one video on the Hack RF, so I want to toss something in here. And this is a very simple uh, capture and replay using Universal Radio Hacker, which is built into Dragon OS. You can see I've got the GitHub page pulled up here. Uh, you can look through some of the recent changes and what it supports, what it can do. Uh, again, it's already pre-installed. And what I'm going to do is uh, I've got, uh, I looked it up here, the model. I've got these uh, Cobra walkie-talkies, about $28. Uh, popped the cover off the back, uh, looked for the FCC ID, uh, punched that in on Google, or you can go straight to this FCC ID.io. Uh, you can see here's the FCC ID. ID. Come down here. I was looking at the frequency ranges. So what we'll do here is pull open a terminal. Universal Radio Hacker URH. Hit enter. Give a second here. Uh, you'll see a little warning down here about making a, a project. I click on new project. And my, I think it's because of my resolution. It's kind of hard to see everything here so I'll just maximize everything uh, we'll make a new directory here the default frequency see I'll go with 46255 uh, can two. Okay. Let's take a look with our spectrum analyzer first. Maximize. I've got the hack RF plugged in. Change that to the hack RF. Hit refresh here. It pulls in the ID. 46255. Uh, we can bump up the gain here. Let's start. We can see it's using the hack RF. Uh, okay. Let's see what we got here. 462. Yep. All right. So we're pretty close there. That was the spectrum analyzer. It gets you uh, an idea if you're close on the frequency. Let's close this out. Let's go ahead and record a signal. Same thing, hack RF. And you can see some of the other uh, equipment that's, you know, maybe we'll try RTL SDR later. Of course, we can't uh, play back with that, but uh, frequency 46255. DC correction, yep. All right, so. save that puts it in our the home users folder the folder that I created just leave it the default name there save that let's close out of this give it a second it'll process that signal uh, you can get down here and uh, it, it does do some auto detect on the parameters to see the modulation uh, you can, there's other tabs to do further analysis. Uh, I won't really mess with the generator and simulator tabs. We're mainly looking at this interpretation. So we save that signal. Now, let's go ahead and play it back. So I've got my Cobra radio here close to the Hack RF. It's turned on. Maximize this. And same thing, hack RF. Hit refresh, a little button here pulls up the identifier. 462. Gain might not be needed, but let's go ahead because uh, we're transmitting. Uh, let's start. Listen up.
Okay, and it'll just do that in a, an infinite loop. There. Okay, stop. And you can uh, kind of dig into this a little more on your own. There's a lot of uh, options. To be honest, some I'm not even familiar with. I haven't did a lot of work with Universal Radio Hacker. Uh, I'd like to try something uh, maybe on my garage door opener or key fob. So, but for right now, that should get you up and uh, running. And again, that's, that's built in.